Hey, Funkmonster, it's just me, the Funkmonster. Yeah, I know. Uh, it has been like a few months since I posted. My cat's here. My goodness. It's been a few months since I last posted a video, huh? Um, yeah, I just haven't been picking up pops. And um, and I've just been like ultra focus on the McFarlane DC Multiverse figures. So. I just haven't been really getting pops, uh, but I did get quite a few recently. Uh, I went to Boston Comic Con, Fan Expo Boston is the new term, I guess, but uh, I got some pops there, uh, and I went to the to the mall today, and I picked up some pops at the mall. So, it's not even Friday, but I'm going to schedule the video for Friday, and yeah, that'll be that, but um... I'm going to try to maybe start reviewing Pops again on the channel. Um, my cat's just rubbing up against the tripod. Uh, mainly just DC Pops, movie Pops, and that's about it. Like, I don't really collect anything outside of those, but uh, one of them is a bit special. You'll see in a moment. But uh, at Boston Comic Con, I did pick up these two right here. I got them for 10 bucks each. Uh, from White Men Can't Jump. Really good movie. Um, I love Woody Harrelson. He's an amazing actor. Uh, and Wesley Snipes was really good in this movie too. So I highly, 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 highly recommend checking this movie out. White Men Can't Jump. Uh, so yeah. That's one. Um, I got some obscure DC characters, which I absolutely love. Obviously, SDCC came as... It left as quickly as it came, and some of the pops I got came in. So one of them being Starfire, uh, which I really, really like. Uh, I think she looks awesome. She sold out, too, which was very surprising to me, but regardless. Um, yeah, no, this looks really cool. I love this pop. It's awesome. And then uh, this is not particularly SDCC. I do have two more. It's over there. I'll just grab it in a second. I got Black Orchid from Walmart. Um, this, I got this months ago. Um, but yeah, she looks really cool. I love the deep cut into DC lore. Um, that's awesome. Uh, and the box I'm not particularly crazy about, but the pot looks really solid. So that's cool. I'm just going to stand up for a minute here. Oh, yeah. So the... Last SDCC pop I got. I got some. I, I got into sodas, and I'll show those in a second. But uh, it's Silk. Um, very cool pop. Uh, I've read the comic where she appeared in this outfit, um, and it's just a really cool looking pop. Um, very. I want to get into reading about this character. So um, yeah, I need to start picking up some books. But yeah, Silk. She's cool. I like her. Um, Spider Man character. Uh, the the uh, last pop I picked up at Boston Comic Con, uh, those came in the mail, uh, is this uh, Swamp Thing. Uh, I had the original pop that's like no, non glowing dark. It's just, it's just Swamp Thing. It's not anything special. So this one, they made like two, three different versions besides the regular one. They made the glowing dark, flocked, and then flocked scented. This is just the flocked. I don't know what he would smell like. Moss? Like, I don't know. Grass? Like, muck? I don't even know. But yeah, no, this pot looks awesome. I love the look of them. Um, the green just looks really cool. Uh, much more vibrant. Uh, but yeah, Swamp Thing is one of my favorite characters. So uh, I, I love getting Swamp Thing products. Um, let me show you the sodas I got. Uh, let's see. So the first one is... So I, I'm, I'm only going to get 10, right? I'm going to keep that true. Uh, and I haven't figured out which other ones I'm going to get. But the first one I ever got was Plastic Man. Whoa. Plastic Man. Uh, I love this character. Again, deep cut into the DC lore. So I absolutely love it. He looks awesome. Uh, and then the other one is Larflees, which is SDCC exclusive. Uh, I don't think it's the Chase, but he looks really cool too. Another deep, deep cut into DC. Uh, so I absolutely love that. And uh, yeah, there you go. Um, they look awesome. Um, I think they look really cool. I'm glad that Funko has found something that's not too gimmicky. Like Dorbs. Like who remembers Dorbs? Um, the Wacky Wobblers. The uh, Pint Size Heroes. 
mystery minis. Um, yeah, it was it was a little much. Um, uh, the vinyl, like the two packs, those those were those. I actually thought those were pretty cool. The the vinyl idols. I could go on. Anyways, um, the next two, uh, I, I got this on the same day as I bought those SDCC Pops online. Uh, Peacemaker from WonderCon or WondersCon or whatever it's called. Uh, I saw him in stock back when it first came out and I was like, you know what, I'm going to wait um, to get him. And I'm so glad that he didn't sell out. Um, he looks awesome. I love Peacemaker. Uh, the show is phenomenal. Um, you know, a couple characters, uh, okay, whatever. Uh, but John Cena is amazing, and his pop is just as amazing. Um, Peacemaker, yeah. He looks sick. I love this. Uh, I'm not getting any more Peacemaker pops, because I do have the Suicide Squad one and that one. Uh, so no more for me. Uh, the other pop, I, another pop I picked up uh, was at Walmart a couple weeks ago. Uh, it is Black Adam. And uh, I don't know if this movie's going to be good. Hopefully it is. I hope all movies are good. But... Uh, this pot looks phenomenal. Um, I think it just looks so cool. Um, the other pops look cool too, but I'm going to hold off first before I pick them up. Uh, I want to see if the movie's good, if I like the movie, um, and then I'll decide whether or not I'll pick up the other toys, including action figures, right? So, yeah, um, waiting on those. But Black Adam looks phenomenal. I, I love this look. Um, very similar to the Superman pose where he's floating. Uh, I, I need to get the red version, the red and blue version of that one, but yeah, Black Adam looks awesome. Very happy to get that. Um, I, I think he's a very underrated character too. Ooh, hit my funny bum. Uh, another pop I picked up from one of my favorite films. It is The Godfather. So I got Vito Corleone sitting in his chair, petting the little kitty cat. Uh, I do have the original one right here, actually. Uh, I was going to pick up the other two from this set. There's the original one. Um, very obviously. Actually, this is a new head sculpt. Wow. Um, this pot's worth a pretty penny now, which is kind of cool. But this pot is more accurate to when he's petting the cat. Um, he was sitting down. You come to me on the day of my daughter's wedding. Um, sometimes they put, like, the words on the on the boxes but i don't think they did for this one yeah no but uh but yeah no this looks awesome um i, I love this movie it's such a good movie um so yeah 50 years of the godfather and uh so i got beat up corleone uh, i'm gonna go pick up the other two soon uh they are at fye so you'll see it on funk friday eventually depending on when i get around to it anyways uh so the last few pops that I picked up. One of them, this is the, the latest pop I picked up. Tom Brady from the Buccaneers. Yes, I love football. All right. And this is my first football pop, which is insane. Um, my best friend Dom got, it's actually on the channel too, it was one of my first videos uh, on Funko Monster. He picked up the, you know, Gronk and Brady when they were on the Pats and I love the Patriots. I'm from New England, so, um, but they're like 160 bucks each. So, uh, but yeah, no, Tom Brady looks amazing. Um, there are some other guys I would mind getting. I would love to get like Stefan Diggs and I think his name's Trayvon Diggs, Josh Allen, um, Gronk, Mike Evans. I don't know. Um, but yeah, no, this looks awesome. I love Tom Brady. I think he's the fucking goat. He is the fucking man. Um, and I uh, am. Yeah, I don't think they're going to do too well this season, though, to be quite honest with you. But regardless. Uh, anyways, the last two pops I got, I'm going to show my favorite pop last, uh, is from the... One of them is from the... Deep, well, the uh, okay. Uh, this is Vigilante... From Peacemaker. The box is not perfect, but none of them were perfect. Uh, holding the chainsaw there. I felt this character got way too goofy towards the end of the uh, season there. Uh, but regardless, um, I think he's a still a very... He was still a very cool character. Another deep cut into DC, which was really cool to see. And uh, I, I hope Funko makes a classic version. Because, uh, like, I have... 
DC Universe Classic version. Ah, he's right there, but he's in the crowd. Um, yeah, like, I, I would love to see, like, a classic, you know, comic book version of this. It would make a great exclusive somewhere. Um, but yeah, uh, Vigilante, he looks awesome. I love him. And then the final pot I picked up recently is my favorite out of all of these. Maybe Tom Brady, um, to be quite honest, but uh, I think every American household should have this pot. And that is eagerly. Uh, this is the most American thing I've ever fucking seen in my entire life. Like, the only th other thing that's just as American is John Cena saying that, like, they caught Bin Laden on live... Well, not live... It wasn't live TV, but they caught Bin Laden and fucking on WWE. And then the crowd just starts chanting USA. Oh, my God, my heart. My, I, I start crying every time I see that. I get goosebumps. Anyways, this is the most American product I own. Um, I think this is more American than the American flag that hangs out in my in front of my house. Um, yeah, this is awesome. I love this pop so much. Um, I will die for Eagly. Um, and he's just a CGI character. It's like, uh, amazing pop. Uh, yeah. K Funko, uh, I, I know you're making a lot of anime pops, but if you keep making DC pops, I will be there. And you keep making, uh, movie pops, uh, I'll be there. And, uh, like, movies that I like. Um, and, uh, yeah, you know, um, please. Make, make, make some older movies. Like, I would love to see, like, Dustin Hoffman. Like, I would love to see some, like, pops from his movies. Like, like, All the President's Men. Or, like, Rain Man. Like, ma I know it's simple. Like, they're in a suit. But, like, come on. Like, that would be so cool. Um, I could go on. Anyways. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you made it to the end, uh, thank you so much. Um, I will try, try to come back on this channel. It's just very, uh, it's, it's, reviewing pops, it's just, it doesn't fulfill my toy reviewing. It's not as satisfying, uh, and, you know, I, I feel bad, but, because, you know, I'm very grateful for how the channel grew and everything, but. I'm just all in on reviewing DC figures, not pops. Um, but yeah, anyways. Uh, stay tuned for stuff. I, I can't really promise anything, but um, yeah. Anyways, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Thanks for watching.